everyone this is a kalpana here so in this video we are going to see a problem on coordinate geometry problem if a b c are pro points so we are given three points a b and c respectively and if a b equals to b c if a b equals to b c that is distance between a b equals to distance between b c then find a solution so we are given three points and a condition that a b equals to b c a b is the distance between a b and b c is distance between b c so using this condition a b equals to b c we have to find the value of unknown a okay given points are a minus 1 comma 1 b 1 comma 3 and c 3 comma a also given condition a b equals to b c we know that distance between any two points is given by d equals to square root of x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square so now we'll consider the condition ab equals to bc so which implies square root of ab 1 x2 minus of x1 which is minus 1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square equals to square root of bc sorry square root of x2 minus x1 3 minus 1 whole square plus a minus 3 whole square okay If you square on both sides, the square and root gets cancelled. Square root of one minus into minus plus one whole square plus three minus one two square whole square equals two square root of Three minus one two square plus a minus three whole square whole square. So the square root and square gets cancelled. So finally you'll get two square is four plus four equals to four plus a minus three whole square. So four four gets cancelled. So finally you get Four equals to a minus three whole square. Since we know that a minus b whole square equals to a square plus b square minus two ab. So now we are going to apply this formula, right? So we get four equals to a square plus three square is nine minus three two is a six a. implies a square plus nine minus six a minus four equals to zero. So from this we get a square minus six a nine minus four is plus five equals to zero. So you can write it as minus five a minus a plus five equals to zero. Okay. Minus five a minus a is minus six a minus five into minus one is plus five, right? So from these two terms, take a common. So you get a minus five minus take minus common from these two terms. So you get minus of a minus five, which is equals to zero. 
Okay, you can take a minus 5 common from these two terms. If you take a minus 5 common, you will get a minus 5 into a minus 1. See, a minus 5 into a minus a minus 5 into 1 is a minus 5. So, you will get a minus 5 plus to 0 or a minus 1 equals to 0. If you will consider this, a minus 5 equals to 0, you get a equals to 5. If you take this minus 5 to right hand side, and if you consider a minus 1 equals to 0, you will get a equals to 1. If you take this minus 1 to right hand side. So therefore, a equals to 5 or 1. Therefore, a equals to 5 or 1. This completes the problem. So we have seen a problem in this video. Hope you will understand. We will see you in the next video. Until then, bye-bye.